So apparently the humidity in Great Britain is just way higher than it is here in the USA. It's something my American mind can't comprehend such humidity. So let's take a look at the most humid places in the world. So this right here has the most humid places in the world with the very light blue and dark blue as the least humid to where the orange and dark red are the most humid. As you can see, like Brazil is incredibly humid. The USA is very humid, but not as bad. Canada is not that humid, really. Um, but let's look at the UK because it must be it must be like Brazil, right? It looks blue from here. Let's zoom in. Oh, that's that's definitely that's definitely blue. Oh, it's 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 so humid there. It's got to be insane. Oh my god, it's so hot here. It's so humid. Those damn yanks don't understand the humidity here. But okay, let's let's compare this just to the humidity in the United States and the different states within the USA. Okay, so here's the United States, the most humid cities in those states. As you can see, the entire southeast, I live in Tennessee, by the way, is in that orange color. But we also have Louisiana and South Carolina, which are in the red. So they are incredibly humid. And we do have one light blue area. So the Pacific Northwest and Alaska are comparable maybe to Great Britain. But the rest of America much, 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 much more humid than Great Britain. But let's look at the most humid city in the entirety of Great Britain, Worthing. Apparently, it's unbearably hot and humid there. What's the weather like there? It's going to be 67 degrees tomorrow as the high, and the humidity is 78 degrees. Okay, so I'm going to use a city in my state, Memphis, Tennessee, as a counterexample, Memphis, Tennessee is 80 degrees at midnight with a humidity of 70%. <laughs> so the temperature in Memphis, Tennessee is over 10 degrees warmer and has about the same humidity at midnight. So here's the thing, Britain. Like, I understand that you've made this like mythical status of Great Britain's heat just being uniquely oppressive compared to the rest of the world, but it's just not. It's like you guys think room temperature is hot. It's probably British heat wave temperature in my home right now, and I'm perfectly comfortable. You guys are just not capable of handling the heat at all. It's like you're like an ice cube out in the sun or something and you just melt under room temperature weather. 